So there's this project that I've been putting off for quite some time now. By the way, this is Levi's room. Fun fact, this is actually the room that I've been sleeping in while I'm at Kira's. Oh, this bed is so cozy. But as you can tell, the room is quite messy right now. Let's clean it up. Now that's way better. Look at that. Levi's room is kind of unique because it's got one, two, three, four, five doors super close together. Let me show you what's in each one. Door number one, the entrance. Door number two, closet. Nice and spacious, too. Door number three, bathroom. Oh my goodness, this bathroom alone is bigger than most household bathrooms I've seen. I mean, just look at the shower. It's taller than me, and wider too, look. Arms reach, oh, I just stepped in some water. Door number four. It's like a playroom-ish area. Yeah. Toy room, playroom, toy storage, storage room, toy room, I don't know. And door number five is by far the most interesting. Check this room out. This is a cold storage room, I believe is what they call it. I like to call it the bunker. You can't tell me this doesn't look exactly like a doomsday prepper's bunker. It's even got the sketchy looking lights and everything. Here is mainly using it to store Levi's room decor. Decorating Levi's room is the project that I've been procrastinating for over a year now. So let me explain. Right before Karen and I separated, I was supposed to decorate Levi's room. Well, obviously, once the separation happened, I completely forgot about this. Fast forward a few more months, we decided that both of us should wait to do this until one of us is settled into our new place. And during that time, Kira did get an apartment, but she knew she wasn't going to be staying there for long, so we waited. And then she got this place, which she's in love with. Truthfully, I'm in love with this place as well. And since it's a home and not an apartment like mine's gonna be, I thought, why not do it here? I just asked her if she could wait for me to do it because a superhero-themed room is like every little boy's dream. I used to dream of it growing up, and so I really wanted to be a part of this. This great experience, and she was nice enough to respect that. It took me a little longer than I expected. I mean, she's been settled in for quite a few months now. I want to say like two or three. But as they say, better late than never, so let's get started. Truthfully, it's been so long that I don't even remember what I got him anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. No, I'll let you do it first. This one, yeah. Damn, it's heavy. You gotta be, you gotta be kidding me right now. Wait, why did we get two of the same thing? What the? Oh, oh, that's sick. Be careful. A, it broke. This was the coolest neon sign I'd ever seen ever. It says Marvel Comics, but it broke. Look at that right there. That's pretty cool. Alright, I think that's everything though, huh? Do you still like the Avengers? Of course, bro! <laughs> okay, good. Just make it sure, just make it sure. Whoa. There we go. Thank you, Teeny. Now we don't want whoa. We don't want to leave here with a mess. So let's make sure we dispose of this. Can't just leave this like that. <laughs> Probably had a little too much fun cleaning all that, but hey, it looks way better now. Also, is there even such a thing as too much harmless fun? Because technically, if it's harmless, you're not putting away your responsibilities, which would harm you. Food for thought. Thought I'd share. Anyway. Getting sushi. Well, we are getting sushi, but the wait is 45 minutes, so while we wait, might as well explore. Look at this tree. How cool is that? That's where we came out of right now. I've never seen something like this before. That is dope. So I got told I couldn't record here without a photo pass. Excuse me, sir. Did you get a photo pass? What the? You're in the way. 
a photo pass, signed some paperwork, and then traded my keys for this thing. But the funny part is, our table's ready. I don't even need this thing anymore. Oh well. Come on, girls, let's go eat. Let's go eat. Yay! And Eric, I went and got one. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it is what it is, though. All right, the food is now here. This is actually our second course. First course was just a whole bunch of veggies, but oh my goodness, were they good. I've been waiting to eat sushi for, I want to say, like a month now. I could be making that up, but it's been a while. Let's see if this lives up to what I've been craving. My expectations. Hold on, my mess. What do you want to dump? Yummy, yeah, yummy. Sorry, I had a quick question. Do I only need one of these because of the camera? If I use my phone, does it matter? The phone doesn't matter. The phone doesn't matter? Oh, okay. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thank you. So, uh, it's not recording that's the problem. It's the camera that's the problem. That's good to know. Next time, I'll just bring this thing. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. You too. All right. Let's finish this room, Levi. God, we did this exactly, Levi. Exactly 19 inches. I'm getting good at this. You get really oh good at this, God. Dad. All right, so we got the professional construction worker out here. How does that look? You did the bottom at 19? Yeah, because look, I saw that this. Oh, wait, I did mess up. I thought that was the top, so I thought 5 6 was this line. Oh, so I did screw it up. You're, you're one inch off. But exactly one inch off. That's really good. <laughs> okay, I finally finished. Oh my goodness, I'm pretty proud of it. I mean, truthfully, I just hung up stuff on the wall. But either way, I'm happy with how it turned out. And now welcome to Levi's newly decorated room. Absolute favorite piece of this whole room is this infinity gauntlet next to this shield I actually wanted to hang this thing up on the wall right here But it's really heavy and I don't have screws strong enough to hold it up Also, I'm not sure if it's really meant to be hung There's no like way to get it to stick past the shield So I think it's just supposed to be like a cosplay or a toy either way Obsessed with these two pieces love this one as well. It's Tony Stark's Heart, look at that. Proof that Tony Stark has a heart. Love that piece. They're the hyper-realistic pieces. I think that's why I like them so much. I love how these pieces as well almost give like a title to the room. And then the fact that this piece just takes up the blank space, that worked out perfectly. Now there's still one last surprise that you guys haven't seen, and that is... Look how cool this place looks with the lights off. Yo! That's sick, dude. I'm obsessed. I like it. I like this room more in the dark than I do with the lights on. I did good. I did good. I feel like I'm living vicariously through Levi by giving him a room like this. This is something I would have died for as a kid. Anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace!